Hey guys, Waller D here. We're back for more Final Fantasy Mystic Quest, and we're gonna jump over this guy and head inside this house because this is Phoebe's house. So Phoebe, where's Trent's are trapped? In the tunnel he was digging under here, the dirt is frozen solid coat, so he can't get out. Can we can't we melt it? Not until we get wake water from the spring of life, but a monster in a wintry cave stole the the Libra Crest, which warps us from a Libra Temple to Light Temple. Holy crap, lots of temple and Libra and life in L. And he's like, what the fuck did you just say? Uh, I got lost at Temple. Well, anyway, we first have to get that whatchamacallit crest back, right? Don't be like me and back in the old days, Benjamin. It was called Libra, damn it. Right, the Wintry Cave. So yes, what you do want to do is steal her heal potions, because these are the first heal potions you'll find in this game. As the moment... For, as the moment progresses, the only way to heal status effects is with the life spell and with the heal spell. Gr granted, uh, Phoebe was definitely prepared for that, but the hero is still kind of lacking the heal spell department. So, I think what you should do is just keep some heal spells off hand so the main character can at least help out. And also, I would suggest you to talk with this young lady. If you have enough GP, then I'll sell my steel helmet to you. Oh, you're telling me I don't have enough GP. No gold. Okay, Stess. How much does this thing cost, lady? Ah, damn it. Yeah, she will actually be able to steal, or sell you her steel helmet. I don't know why the hell she has one. Maybe it's her boyfriend's. And she will gladly, uh... It will gladly do some Stess or help you in the defensive department. Move, lady. What do you have to say? Uh-huh. So you're saying there's a monster in the Ice Pyramid that's making everything go wrong. Phoebe, you better not be giving me any misinformation about- Oh, you really need some wake water! That'll help everything! I hope so. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna say screw the Steel Helmet because I don't think we really need it that bad. We're gonna head into the Wintery Cave, the next big dungeon of the game. And the Wintery Cave is filled with scorpions, hedgehogs, and other assorted enemies that will be proving to be a little bit on the annoying side, but with your axe and Phoebe's help, and striking first, fuck yes, we can probably get through this place pretty good. <clears throat> fuck you. Damn it, main character, you need to be as strong as Phoebe now. So as you can see, Phoebe really powerful with the strikes. Ow, rape ear, rape ear, damn it. So as you can see, enemies don't fuck around if they critical hit you to death. Jesus. So, Benjamin just like, ate that critical hit. Damn it. Oh yeah, did I mention that or er, scorpions pretty much will poison you? Derp. So yes, uh, be careful of that. And also the rape here, because that's their worst attack big time. Hurts like hell, if, especially if it crits, and as you can see, the one the main character can't withstand one hit of that. And apparently he can't withstand holding an axe because he keeps fucking missing. Great. How about you use a sword, genius? My goodness, people. There you go. I swear. It's like you give somebody a sword and they decide to be like I can crit. Awesome. Yeah, that battle was a lot harder than it probably should have been, but it was fun. Damn, though. Really gotta be careful around these fuckers. Luckily, Phoebe has a lot of white spell uses, so fuck yes. And why the hell am I going for brown chest, damn it? Should've shown you off, asshole. Especially there being less of you. So I would honestly suggest sticking to bombs in this area, because for some re in some cases, bomb will pretty much clean up the mess that Phoebe may have left of the last enemy like that. Ow. He's smacking with your tail, asshole. Do, 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 do. I think I'll switch my axe. Mm, fuck you. Do, 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 do. So yes, Phoebe definitely doing wonderful things. I will probably also try to show off Phoebe's magic, even though I kind of want to keep it for a later uh, boss coming up in the future. But Phoebe's magic is pretty fucking impressive. Let's compare with the main character, just to show off how impressive it is. Fire! As you can see, these guys are also weak against us. 784, holy shit. And comparing to main character, 610. WTV. So yes, as you can see, those guys fucking will... Those guys really don't like fire. So, damn. And 
Phoebe's just critting out the ass today. Makes me think that uh, she has some issues with these kind of animals. Nevertheless, you know what to do with landworms. You just beat them up with a fucking axe. Let Phoebe take care of the things that are not so landwormish. Do do. Mm. Oh, what the hell, main character? Oh shit, paralyzation. Quicksand, I think that will lower your speed by the number that drops down. And of course, quake upside my face. Aho! Aho, game, what the fuck? So, damn, so maybe I'm a little low leveled here, but that's fine, I guess. Oh, dick! Oh no, blind now? Well, I guess I'll vaguely take that. These guys love quicksand today. Killing that guy, I think Phoebe's gonna start spamming magic again because she's not. Oh shit, they have rape. Fucking hell again! Can you guys stop using rapier, damn it? Scrunch! Ow. Okay, so having really bad luck with freaking pointy things today, and main character just keeps dropping like a fly. Scrunch! Ow. Don't, 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 don't. I'm pretty sure that she'll miss or actually hit with while blind. Awesome. So Phoebe can pretty much shoot guns without looking. Awesome. Okay, so we are slowly getting through this place with a crutch. Just, I'm just in shock of how much I'm getting my ass kicked, but that's awesome. Oh, oh shit. Fuck. Damn it. Well, thanks a lot, Phoebe. Way to just, like, not grab me while I was falling. Main character could have broken legs, bodies, gotten a con er, gotten a concussion, all the above, dang it. This claw saved me, here's how to use it. Select the claw, hold the 8 button down, and press the damn it control pad and fourth wall breaking. And now it's yours! Yes, and now Phoebe was apparently hiding a even stronger weapon. And she gives you her own weapon, so it's kind of nice that Phoebe is very generous like that. And yes, Phoebe's attack has jumped to 87. You may think that's good news, but I'm actually looking at the bad side of it as well. Just imagine Phoebe when she's confused and doesn't know who to fucking hit as a target. Guess what's gonna happen to the main character? He's probably gonna die in one fucking hit. So, keep that in mind. Also, since her weapon is so damn awesome, it, it has the ability to blind people, so keep that in mind, if you're shooting it around like crazy. So now that you have the claw, follow the instructions that Phoebe gave you, and you can now climb these walls awesomely. Yes, I know it's so empty. Kinda like this music. Oh shit, you. You. Yeah, these guys are annoying as hell, so be proceed to beat the shit out of them. Mm. As you can see, Phoebe does one-shot those guys. Awesome. And it's gonna help. Problem is, is that these guys can ribble on their first turn. That's what you gotta worry about. You wanna hope they hit the main character, because if uh, Phoebe is the target, you're gonna be in a world of pain if she decides to make you a, a freaking pincushion. But then again, she could use fire, which is equally bad. Please don't make kill him. Damn it, again, not good. Thank you for killing the worm and not with yourself. <sighs> How the hell do you kill yourself with a bow and arrow? It's like, oh, what's this do? Shoot yourself in the frickin' head with it. Wow. That would be pretty depressing, honestly. Nevertheless. Main character got his ass kicked, and Phoebe's feeling all good about making two enemies suffer. Another thing to tell you about, instead of wasting your time with all this uh, going around logic, because there is a nice wonderful shortcut that you can take, as opposed to making all these wonderful uh, trip all over the damn place. I'll just show you a minute. Drop down here. Maybe not that way. And here's the thing that the game doesn't tell you. I guess I'm gonna have to kick your ass real fast. So yes, as like I said, the game loves to hide a little secret passage in once in a while. Please take advantage of that. Ow, pain. Mm, suck on some cat claw. 
that seemed to suck ass. And a fucking critical hit again. My goodness, is Rapier like supposed to crit every five seconds? Yeah, suck on that, receiving it, bastard. Dude. Damn it, Cat Call, you are very fucking weak in those things. Stick with the axe. Do, 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 do. And Benjamin levels up, thank goodness. Okay, here's the thing about this area that you should know. You can take a shortcut by going under the... Under all that. Awesome. And it will save you from doing all of this. Going to fight those enemies on this little ledge. And you don't really need to worry about anything like stupid boxes of brown. Alright, let's kick your ass real fast, buddy. And if the battles get a little bit too tedious for me, I might skip them because... I'm pretty sure you guys get the idea of how to kill these fuckers. Just have Phoebe shoot them with arrows to death or use fire spells. Oh, looks like your paralyzation failed, buddy. Mm. Fuck yeah. Do, 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 do. Do, do. So yes, we're getting pretty good distance in this cave. I don't know if we're going to beat in this video. I think at the very least we'll probably get out of this big-ass room. Hey, giant toads, you're new. Oh, Phoebe, you take care of the freaking scorpions because they're a little bit more threatening. I'll take care of the big ass toad. Apparently, he's now having a bloating issue. Holy crap. Whip tongue. Ow, 31. Not bad. Yep, you're dead. Alright, so that takes care of that. Let's make some more progress up here. And this is definitely the place I need to be. But first, let's use some of those more wonderful cure potions that seem to vaguely help me. At least they're not bad for doing small wound he healing. Sup, punk? Let's go! Let's see. Ah, shit, man. More of you. Do I think I'm gonna start using some fire spell, even though I vaguely am regretting that idea, but... I don't think I have any other better, better options here. Do, 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 do. Ow, damn it, Paraneedle, stop doing that. So yeah, as you can see, Paraneedle is not 100% effective with the uh, status effects, which is kind of a nice thing because that can be a problem. Ooh. These guys are pretty easy. These guys just require an axe to a frickin' face and they will gladly die in hopefully one hit. It has, to, it has to mean that the character has to be a certain strength. Well, unfortunately, he is not today, damn it. Damn it, main character, you need to start lifting weights and kicking ass. Because, look, Phoebe's just outdoing you twice times over, damn it. Care potions? Arrows, awesome. Still more view, because the, 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 uh, what is it, land turtle population is starting to look, look a little creepy today. Mm, suck on that. Dirt. Nice. Dude, Paraclaw? Wow, lots of lots of status effects run around this place. I mean, sure there's a lot of poison in the Bone Dungeon, but here it's like paralyzation, confusion, blind. Gotta really be careful around here if you want to be effective and kicking a lot of ass. Uh, crap, Cenotars. I think Cenotars probably wouldn't like their hooves getting smashed against the ground so violently. <clears throat> You're a crit! Damn, Phoebe. You always crit against your enemies? And apparently Landworm is weak against the spell that he uses on you. What the hell? That's some weird logic game. Shit, and Phoebe just shot herself an arrow. Fuck. And main characters decide to miss. And now everybody's confused. It's a fucking wonderful confusion party. Damn it. Wake the hell up. There we go. Fuck you. So the main character, out of freaking anger and hate for the enemy, just like decided to say "fuck this" and shit, and did what needed to be done. Thank God. Maybe you need to stop having to heal yourself every five seconds, damn it. And yes, life spells out out of battle make for good full healing. So just in case you don't want to waste like 15 cure potions to heal yourself, there's that option. Do, 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 do. You know, hold on while I kill these fuckers real fast. And better yet, I think I'm going to end the video here after I kill these fuckers. So, uh, next time, guys, we're going to try to get further through this place. And, uh, see if we can get to the boss and steal that Libra Crest that he was 
so holding dearly for the enemies. So thanks for watching, have a great day, and adios. Killing you. Mm. Yeah, fuck yeah. See you later.